Okay, so. It's not bad, this. Here comes Evo. Back it up. It's a pretty cool view from up here. Yeah. You're not going to get that kind of off. It's making a lot of ease. Standing over here, I just kind of falling slow. But it's. Alright, Lambo's going to be coming back on the other side. Yeah. Alright, that hurricane even was coming back over here. Okay, should I stay up here and get the Hurricane Evo, or should we go down there? Screw this, we're going down. I want to see this Evo come in. I've seen it before, but... Get the McLaren quick. Alright, we're going to go. Pass Beer's amazing 1400 horsepower Shelby Cobra. Look at that thing. Look at all these. What do you think? What's your favorite car here? Come on, people. Leave me some comments. We have Ferraris in the corner. Tesla for all the haters. Breaking out the slow pokes, merch. I spent all, I spent all my money on my shoes. He said, man, we feel like we ripped you off. We got the Acura NSX. Yeah, I figured that uh, the Huracan was going to be coming back on this side. That's why I got down off my perch. This is at uh, Halifax Convention Center, aka Roger Square. You got to follow Slowpokes. And drop a Rari on uh, Instagram. They do this once a year. This is the third year. Last year was Supercar Sunday. This year Supercar Saturday. So all the Slowpokes cars are here. Well, almost all. The Huracan, Lamborghini Huracan Performante is not here. But the Evo was just here, but it just left. But we got uh, so many sick cars. I mean, obviously Ferraris and shit. But um, the purple GT3 RS. Yeah, the SVs in New Brunswick, is it not? I know they're supposed to have a special guest because they've never done bleachers before. They've always had this event, but they've never had the bleachers. But this GT3 RS is insane. But this Mustang, yeah, I heard it. There was a blue GR Corolla that just went by. This Mustang, the Spears the Amazing's Mustang, Shelby Cobra. This thing has 1,400 horsepower. These really tight. Like, look at the size of the calipers on this shit. And the friggin' uh, those tires are like a foot and a half wide. They're insane. Not a lot of people see it to say, ooh, it's a Mustang, but this thing's nuts. I got some videos I'll post later of him revving it at Steel Wheels this morning. Hey, you wanna see the craziest shit? Look at this. Yeah. 1400, it's insane. Look at this McLaren. This thing just pulled up a few minutes ago. Oh, the ship box is in. Yeah, I was just talking to this guy a little while ago. I said, buddy, you got to come to Supercar Saturday. <laughs> oh, oh. 
<laughs> Any new B car and brother cars down there? Yeah, um, the R8, the yellow R8 with all the carbon fiber hood and stuff. Uh, MCR8, loving it. This is Instagram, he's here. He's at the other end right now. Yeah, no more tires. Yeah, Spears Amazing has that like, YouTube money. He can pay for tires whenever he wants. I was talking with this guy earlier about his uh, ship appeal. He said the AC still works in it. I mean, it's kind of pointless with no windows and door, but... Ozzy, they're letting them park down on the road there. The ship would be able to draw more people in. The 50th anniversary Hot Wheels Camaro. C8 Corvette. We'll go back in here. For everybody's wondering, Roger Square, Halifax Convention Center is where we're at. Keep getting distracted. I haven't had a chance to go around the McLaren yet. He's too close to the damn wall. To these bleachers. Let's check it. Dude realizes his car's still in. This thing's crazy. Oh, you want to see the Hot Wheels Camaro? Okay, we're going to go over there right now. It's pretty sweet. It's the Crash Camaro. Follow him on Instagram. And he's also got uh, orange underglow on it. I won't show you yet. We'll just sneak right up on it here. All right, the C8. Here we go. Here we go, the Crush Camaro right here. Actually, the owner of the Crush Camaro is sitting right there, too. That's it. You own the Crush Camaro, don't you? I do. Yeah. Cool, man. I'm just... I'm 902 Motors on Instagram. Oh, right Yeah, on. yeah, I'm just doing it live, and I had a guy ask me about New Brunswick cars and stuff, and then he was talking, I was talking about this. Oh, so. right on. Yeah, it's one I'm of, taking requests. It's 124. <laughs> yeah, it's yeah. 124 in Canada. There you one go. Of 241 worldwide. Did you get that? Yeah, he was asking what the Camaro looked like, so I had to bring him over, and I told him to follow you on Instagram. Did you see the little Hot Wheels car in the dash there? No, I didn't see that. Oh, okay, we're working our way it around actually, now. This car was designed off that Hot Wheels Oh, sweet. And I know you've got the orange underglow, too. Yes. Uh, and that car is actually number 50 in the series of 365. Okay, cool. So, so here we go. Look. Here's the badge. So we said there's only like 50 of these made in Canada. Or sold in Canada, I guess. Yeah, for sure. There's the limited edition. Oh, I can't even get a good shot. I have to check that out. Oh, you got the, oh, he's got the matching sneakers and everything. The sneakers came, there you go. With, like, came out for the car itself. That's crazy. Yeah. This is the first car that actual Mattel themselves came out with an anniversary car to celebrate their 50th. You mind if I grab the Hot Wheels for a second? Go ahead. A second. That's cool. So this. That car, that die cast came first and they designed the car and the wheels and everything off Look that, at that die cast. Exactly the same. Isn't that crazy? So that's it's super cool. 50 in the series, too. Right on. Cool, that's super cool. Awesome. There you go. There you got the 50th. Awesome. Thanks, man. That's yeah, super cool. Yeah. Should be lots of people later, especially cool. for the 
football game and stuff? Well, yeah, I heard a couple guys are just putting the Ferraris in parking here and then going down to the CFL game. Yeah, just a couple of them are going later. I went last year to the one, uh, where was it at, uh, Acadia there? That was a good time. But it was so goddamn hot, people were just dropping. People were getting hammered. They were putting cases of water down on the ground just, and just leaving them. Where we were, like in the end zone, we were right by the broadcast booth. It was wicked, because we were up there talking with everybody during the broadcast <laughs> and stuff. Oh, it was so much fun. Yeah, oh, and Matt Dunnigan tripped and got a gash in his leg and was bleeding. Oh, it was insane. It went right through his pants. Yeah, it was crazy. <laughs> but uh, it was super fun. Yeah, today even breathe a bit, but it'll be hot in the stands there in full sun. All those fumes are usually like a wind tunnel, though. Yeah, my brother played football there growing up, so. Yeah. <laughs> cool, good talking to you, thanks. Toronto. No, Toronto. It seems like big time Toronto cars, but check this out. I don't even have to say where I'm at, because we are at Halifax Convention Center. I know people don't believe me that we're in Halifax with all these crazy ass cars, but uh, these are all local cars. There's only, I think, one so far that's not Nova Scotia. Look, we'll check the plates. Ferraris and McLaren. I know that one's Nova Scotia, but let's check it out. Nova Scotia Ferrari. Scotia McLaren, Nova Scotia Panamera, Nova Scotia Ferrari, yeah, one McLaren, I don't know what happened to that Lamborghini, there was the Huracan Evo, the matte gray one, he went to pull in and then turned around, what's going on man, just Interacting with random people. And you had people asking me random questions. Like, where's that Toronto? I was like, no, nope, Halifax. <laughs> <laughs> they just turned around the uh, the shit, uh, the shit uh, from uh, Trailbreak Boys. I think they got in the park just outside there. He was at Steel Wheels. And I was oh, talking sick. with him for a bit. So, nice it's be like, yo, he's super nice. I've been there once before, but I, I mean, I have to go see it just for like nostalgia's sake. Look at this rolling in. Oh, that guy's driven by a few times. Wow, this classic car, but. Yeah, the shipmobile tried to pull right in, and they're like, no, 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 turn around. Dude, they should have. Just, had, they put it, like, right here. Yeah, because he was at steel wheels. I'm wondering what they got going on with these bleachers. They've never done bleachers before. No, I don't remember that. But and they said there's going to be a special guest, so. And there's still room down the middle. Might be. I have, I have a feeling. Uh, the Greg new set, the 720S. True, Maybe. but there's also a brand new Lamborghini SV in New Brunswick. Oh, okay. That people are talking might be here so who knows you know what? I'll hey leave a comment let me know what you think the special car is going to be <laughs> yeah. I'll accept either one yeah I know Graciously. I mean I this car here is a Nova Scotia car this McLaren and I've only ever seen it once before it was like last year up on Larry Utech they had a meet and I got a video of a Revan from behind was this here at Driven last year do you remember I don't think so no, I just remember a black McLaren I don't know but. Yeah, it's kind of cool. I've had people ask me questions and stuff. So I just went over the Crash Camaro because that's only like one of 50 cars made in Canada, Canada, the Hot Wheels edition orange Camaro. And it was actually built off of the die-cast Hot Wheels car that's on his dash, which is number 50 of whatever. And his car, I think, was number 50 as well or something like that. Anyways, he opened it up and, and he's got Puma Hot Wheels shoes that go with the car as well because I knew there were some promenades kind of behind it but I didn't know the whole story so he just kind of walked me through it he's not over there right now but he actually looks like Ken Block and has a Ken Block shirt on okay. but uh, but yeah it's a super cool story oh, right yeah yeah exactly yeah, I mean, the guy looks like Ken Block exactly. and is wearing the Ken Block shirt like literally if you had said that's probably him and he just grew his beard yeah. out you're like yeah and the back of it just says just don't die and I was like oh <laughs> <laughs> yeah yeah, man, go get some pictures. All right, I keep hearing revving in the distance, but... Oh, here we go. That's what everybody came to see. Fresh out of the Halifax Harbor. The Harbor Hopper. I wonder if there's a cruise ship in. Okay. If you're just joining us, what's your favorite supercar? Could it be the 1,400 horsepower... Oh, Shelby Cobra. 
owned by Spears the Amazing, the YouTuber. That insane purple GT3 RS. One of the many Ferraris, Porsches, the friggin' uh, Vipers up there, the F Type, Jag. We got a bunch of Benzes lined up down the side. We got a police car. There's a black Ferrari up there. Too many to count. There's GTS. It's hard to beat. This McLaren. Still waiting to see what this special guest is supposed to be. Kind of a unique view. You ever seen a McLaren from the top? We got speculation as to what the special guest is going to be today. What time of day is it? Quarter after 11. This is only supposed to start at 11 and they were here at like 20 after 10, so. I don't know. Is it going to be Greg Doucette's new uh, McLaren? Or is it going to be the New Brunswick owned Lamborghini SV? And what the hell happened to the uh, gray Lamborghini Huracan Evo that was here and then took off? So many questions. And this fucking Land Rover here with the tent on the top is pretty slick. All down the side here. We got it. That's the uh, Acura R8. You can barely see a little bit of it. It's got the red underglow on it. And then behind the Viper hood is another black Ferrari. And to everybody's dismay, there's a Tesla. But I'm pretty sure that's Grandpa Ferrari's Tesla. So. He's got enough street cred to rock it. And they got some slow pokes merch up there. I wish they had the underground snacks booth again, because I'm thirsty as hell. So true. Yeah, it would have been nice to see the uh, was it a GT3 or GT4 that they auctioned off? No, the one they auctioned off from Porsche. That was like for twenty-seven thousand dollars. But again, there's a lot more exotic cars than this in the province. These are just the ones that belong to slow folks. It's such a cool venue with all the friggin' uh, screens and stuff. Although I'm pretty sure they're just using the same videos from us. And this car's not there, that just showed the Huracan Performante convertible. I don't know where he is. He could have brought his Bentley too. Dude's got money. Well, I might take a break from this live. It's waiting to see if more cars are coming, but I don't know what's going on. We'll be back when something cool happens. Peace.